take 254. Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Fitzhogan11, and welcome to episode 1 of Pokemon Eclipse version. Uh, this is a ROM hack of Pokemon Fire Red, and if you would like to play along with me, the link will be down in the description below. Check out the game, download it for yourself, patch the game and all that good stuff. Uh, so this is a Fire, Fire Red ROM hack, and uh, I'm really excited to play it. It's 4 gym beta, uh, which is plenty of length. Uh, so, I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, we'll definitely have a lot of content to explore. Uh, so, I really didn't expect this to come out, so it was kind of just thrown out there, and I'm really happy that it was. Uh, I think it looks really good. Uh, it's not like uh, super hardcore with the features, I guess, but uh, it definitely looks good, and I think there will be a really good storyline. So. Uh, that's always my favorite part of these Pokemon games, uh, creators, uh, new storylines and all that, so, uh, let's see, is this our dad? I'm busy right now, Dave, we can talk later, okay. I guess that's okay. Dave, how are you? Come here, I'd like to do something for you. Alright, your father is supposed to feed the Mareep, but he just won't leave the computer, that's why I want you to go instead. We got the berry pouch, come back when you're, when you're finished. Alright, sounds good to me. Uh, let's see, I guess we gotta feed them all. Let's see if we say no. Oh, we have to, alright. That's fine. Uh, so I think we get ten berries, and we use five of them, so... We have another five for our journey. And that is why I am a math major. Have you fed the Mareep? Thank you so much. Father wanted to talk to you, he's still upstairs, alright. There you are, I was looking for you. There's something I need, uh, so I can finish what I'm working on. Okay. Could you get it for me? A uh, disc I left at Mr. Briney's. Okay. We got the running shoes, and don't forget to get your shinks from your mother. Okay. Cool. Sounds good to me. Uh, we got a lonely shink, so that's plus attack. Uh, that should be really good early on. Um, but we're probably going to be using Shockwave for now, since it is a stab move. And I guess we can't go this way. Oh, we can. Alright, I'm going to go this way, though, because I think this is the direction we have to go. I've only played a little bit of this game, uh, so I really don't know too much about it. And we'll all explore it together. Uh, I don't know if Mr. Brian, I like Mr. Briney, we know from the original games, I don't know if our father is like Ruby or something, or there's no connection at all, really. Professor Oak is staying here. I came for a Pokemon. He said it was too young. Alright. Uh, so she knows us. I guess we live in town. Uh, let's see. Something sparkling over there. What could it be? Good question. Alright, let's see. Door is locked. Oh, here we go. You didn't come for a Pokemon, did you? You already have one. Let's make a deal. If you find and challenge all four trainers I've given Pokemon to, I'll give you a rare item. Sounds good to me. Okay. Uh, there's an unlocked room in here. What could possibly... I, uh, there's nothing? Alright. I guess we can explore later on. If we want to. So, uh, let's go find Mr. Branny. I'm guessing that's not Mr. Branny. I don't know if Mr. Branny's aged or anything. Maybe we won't even recognize him. Who knows? We're on the fairy path. I think that's how you pronounce it, I don't know. Uh, game slowed down a little bit, that's strange. Uh, so he's gonna start out with a Squirtle. I guess that's perfect for our first battle. And we're gonna take him out. There we go. Uh, so I'm guessing Professor Oak's trainers will have the starting three and maybe Pikachu or something. Or maybe Eevee. Uh, is that a berry right there? Oh, a Lepa berry. I'll have to be on the lookout for that then. Level 7, and can tackle Bulbasaur. There we go. Alright, so that's two trainers down. And Professor Oak will give us a rare prize or something like that. Uh, Orenberry. I'm actually going to attach that to Shanks, and there we go. This kid's got a Charmander. 
I thought uh, the trainers get progressively harder, but I guess the girl is the best trainer of them all with a Starly already. That will help her out quite a bit. And maybe we'll use Starly. Who knows? Uh, so we got to check out this forest, I guess. This is where my Mr. Briny is. Uh, we got a Petra Berry. Oh, here we go. Somebody help. This Wingle attack is attacking me. Okay. Fuchiana, use Tackle. Ha, that should do it. Okay, are you defending this Wingle? Why? Do you think I'm the Egg Thief? I am not. I don't even know anything about an Egg Thief, but I guess as you mentioned it, I'll take you out. Seems easy enough for me. And we grow to level 9. There you go, you win, but I, you can't prove I'm the Egg Thief. I'll just get rid of this bag with the eggs and... Uh-oh. What's this? We've been having reports of a suspicious guy hi hiding here in Oracle Forest. Turns out it's the Egg Thief. Okay. You stopped the Egg Thief. Thanks to you, the, all the stolen eggs will be returned safely. Alrighty. How much thanks I get? I expected, like, a Pokeball or something. Oh, we found a Pokemon egg. Okay. Uh, so Wingle's gonna return to its trainer. I guess that's where the Egg Thief was hiding out. Uh, I wish we could have explored that. That would have been cool. Uh, we can explore this part of the forest, I guess. And I'll actually attach another berry. Because why not? Let's see. Okay. Just trainer tips. Alright, so we're getting a lot of berries early on, which is kind of nice. I didn't expect that. Uh, we got a shiny potion right there. And that might be it. Alright, so uh, for some reason I ran into the wrong part of the forest and got me into a lot of trouble and it froze my game. So I don't really know what that was about, but uh, for beta 1 at least I wouldn't go off to the right of the forest if I was you. I met some high level trainers and then I froze my game when I talked to someone, so I don't know, maybe I should, shouldn't be there yet. <laughs> Uh, but we'll talk to Mr. Briny here. Uh, Hoy Fitz, Pico's returned. You came for your disc. Okay. Uh, I need to speed up the text again. So I had to restart my game, but that's okay. And we will return our disc. And get to the next city, maybe? Let's see. Alright, now all I have to do is install and done. Finish, you can now deposit and withdraw Pokemon. Okay, here's a Lunar Wing. Uh, something about communicating with Pokemon. Okay. Uh, so, would I like to nickname Shinx? Sure. Uh, let's see. I'll go with Sparky. Uh, so, we'll make it to the next city and then we'll end the episode. Uh, but we'll figure out what we want to catch next. I'm not really sure. Let's see. These crops could grow in almost any soil, but the loom loam around here is the best. I don't know what loam is. Uh, either way, some more farms. Let's see, nothing here. And maybe a trainer? Alright, so we'll finish up on that. Uh, these guys, and then next episode we'll figure out what our second team member is going to be. I really have no idea. You found me, someone's been stealing my crops, so I'm hiding until I catch them. Okay. Cool. I guess that's a pretty good idea. And... Oh, Wismer was it. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. We made it to Sienna City. Uh, this is a pretty crazy place, as I remember. So, Fitz, I've been waiting for you. You've never visited a big city before, right? Alright, so she's going to show us around. And... Uh, let's see. You two are here for registra registration. I'm afraid they're halted as most tutors are looking out for Headmaster Glamio. The Headmaster's Glamio. Alright. So, I've prepared for this test for years. I'm not just going to sit around and wait. I'll, I'll find the Glamio myself. Alright, so we'll find Glamio in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all later. Bye.